all right so welcome to today's lesson um as usual we're talking about what i was expecting the previous week uh, and versus what actually happened in the markets for the past week and then what i'm expecting to happen in the coming week or so so the past week is from 31st i'm uh, sorry from 30th um, of may to um, 3rd of june okay um, what i was expecting in the market and what actually happened and then talk about what i'm be expecting in the coming week or <clears throat> that's from the 6th of june to the 10th of june okay um, so actually let's go into the charts there's a dollar index a daily chart and as usual that's what i started you know for the past week i was talking about the fact that um, i was expecting price this particular candle right here is i think sunday's open yeah this sunday's open this is monday tuesday wednesday thursday and then friday okay in that order okay so the previous week i was expecting price to have a retracement okay up into the low of this particular candle right there like that okay so that was what i was expecting um, i think on the wednesday um, we actually had that thing that's happening okay on this particular candle but price didn't really get to that particular low the high on this particular candle is uh two one two zero okay so the high on this particular candle is um 102.713 the, the low here is the low there is 102.742 you know the other one is point seven one three this is point seven four two okay so just a little bit far away and then on thursday we dropped lower okay so this was what i was expecting the previous week um something like that okay um dropping below up to this particular low somewhere <coughs> all right so that's what i was expecting um in the coming week um but yet you know price didn't really give me that uh, it's give me this particular price leg over here okay but this part price leg couldn't finish so this coming week is very simple and short i'm actually um going by what i was expecting in the coming in the previous week all right because we couldn't fulfill that in the coming in the previous week you know price can really drop down to this area right here let me somewhere here okay this is most likely region for price to reach and that's 100.6 zero but you know what actually negates this particular idea is the fact that should monday and tuesday if you should trade above this particular high over here okay if price trades above this particular high okay then my bearish stance on this um dollar index on the daily time frame is negated okay then i have to have a change of mind and then go the reverse okay so, but as it stands as now i'm still bearish on the dollar index and then i'm looking for price to drop much lower on the dollar index okay so that is it and then as i expect this in the dollar index uh, let's take a look at the usd let me see let's take a look at the usd okay so me expecting do dollar to drop um i was actually expecting you know the usd to have a treatment from where it was i think somewhere to drop much lower somewhere 
key and then we tackle this particular area right here now if you watch the previous video you'll see all these things in it you know i was looking for this particular area to be rich in in the in last week trade okay um that's from the 30th to the 3rd of june um but you know we had this price like lower just as we had that price like higher or or that particular retracement in the dollar index the reverse was seen in the new usd and then reaching up this particular price like was not you know delivered so i'm looking forward to this particular price like in the coming week to reach out to this particular area over here so that's my expectation for the dollar index in the end of usd i'll see you when i talk about this same thing again in the after this particular week's trade okay so have a nice trade